wonder what's living down inside the pond. Let's take a look under the water and find out. Wow, I've never seen the bottom of a pond before. There's so many amazing plants and animals. Let's make our own pond. Great idea. Let's start our pond by adding rocks. Tap on the book if you want to hear about the things you can add to the pond. Great! Now there's lots of places for the animals to live and hide. Let's keep going! Underwater plants. Floating plants. Ooh! Now we get to pick a plant to add. You can always use my book to hear more information. Underwater plants will help feed lots of pond animals. I wonder who will eat them. Let's look around. Wow, this is so interesting. Let's keep going. Now we get to add animals to the pond. Ponds need lots of different plants and animals to stay healthy. Let's pick one and see what happens. Worm, snail. These wiggly worms are so tiny. I wonder what other small animals live in the pond. I notice that each time we chew something, the pond changes. Look, we're going up. I wonder what we'll discover. Different creatures live here, in the middle of the pond. I wonder what they are and what they eat. Fly larva. These larvae become bright, colorful dragonflies when they grow up. They look so different as babies. We could take a closer look at the plants and animals in the pond with this magnifying glass. Move the magnifying glass over a plant or animal and click it to see it up close. The dragonfly larva has a big bottom lip that helps it to keep up food. What do you notice? Tadpole. Scavenger beetle larva. Wow! I wonder how many tadpoles are here. Count how many you see. Scavenger beetle larva. Caddisfly larva. These larvae become beetles when they grow up. Imagine how different they will look. This frog is the grown up of the tap will be added. Now we're near the pond's surface. I wonder how the animals will be different here. Pumpkin seed sunfish. Red spotted newt. These little fish have lots of fun colors. What do you notice about the colors of the animals in the pond? Red spotted newt. Spotted bass. Look carefully to spot the differences between the pond creatures. What do you notice about the animal sizes? Red spotted newt. Yellow bullhead catfish. This fish is called a catfish because it has feelers on its face that look like cat whiskers. This dragon 
amplifies the grown-up of the larva we added. We've reached the top! I wonder what new things we'll discover. Teal Duck, Map Turtle. Ducks have special webbed feet that help them paddle through the water. I wonder what other animals have webbed feet. Heron, Kingfisher. Kingfishers have pointy beaks that help them go fast when they dive into the water. Map Turtle, Heron. Map Turtle's strong beaks are perfect for eating their favorite food, snails. Exploring. You can keep exploring, or you can make another pond. Do you want to start a new pond? <laughs>